Hi, welcome to Queen Strawberry Farm. You see, it's strawberry. Strawberry everywhere. Oh, they have bakery, they have restaurant, fishing village, and they also have a hotel. They only have 50 pesos entrance fee and then consumable. We'll see what we got here. <laughs> so that's the Queen's restaurant. Hi guys, so we got na kami. And we realized that na the strawberry is on March. Pa. And it's February today. There's no strawberry. Walang kahit ano. They only have flowers. So it's a bit wrong timing kami sa um, excited na lang ako to try yung pagkain nila. So I ordered strawberry cheesecake, of course. And their coffee. Wag muna tayo mag rice kasi medyo maaga pa. Pero, yeah. And yes, we are heading out kung saan yung photoshoot area and for events as well. Here, we are going to Tagaytay. Dito kami mag stay for the night. And yes, that is the view. We are staying in the city proper ng Tagaytay. 15 minutes away from Queen's Farm. And now we are here sa famous Bulaluhan here in Tagaytay. As you can see, my pila, and of course, the view deck is amazing. Kasi kita kita mo yung taan lake. And hindi mako completo yung stay ninyo sa Tagaytay if hindi niyo matra yung bolalo. Of course, Tower Ground offers the one of the best bolalo in town, in air in Tagaytay. So we are back here to stop next year in Tagaytay and we visited earlier yung Queen's Strawberry Farm then wala kaming nakita strawberry so we are saan po na namin because we had lunch noong Caesar salad with strawberry and we had yung special strawberry cheesecake which is really good, I recommend. Aside from Queen's Strawberry Farm, they also have yung souvenir shop. You can also do fishing. May mga entrance fee sila. And then 50 pesos yun. It's consumable ng food and souvenir. Then aside from Queen's Strawberry Farm, yung the usual na libutan. Tourist spots sa Tagaytay is the lake. Overview yung sa picnic grove and sa People's Park. So if you guys are traveling to Tagaytay, the only requirements that I is if you're fully vaccinated, you just have to present the vaccination card. And if you're not, you just have to present the negative RT-PCR test and the checkpoint or in the property that you're visiting. So, and yeah, it's very hassle-free and it's safe. Just in case you guys know this, it's been a year since I last posted my hike video. I'm sorry that I haven't been able to post new videos because I've been very busy lately. And some of my friends told me that I should post more. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy. And I'll see you on the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe on my YouTube channel. I'll see you guys soon.